Hey guys, Gizby here. What I'm going to do today is show you how to flash your phone. You can flash CWM with this. You can flash a full ROM with this tool. It's SP Flash Tool. You will need ADB drivers installed and you'll need the SP Flash Tool software. You can get both of those from ChinaPhoneArena.com. I'll put links in the description. So the first thing you want to do is load your scatter. This is basically a map of your phone and it tells you where each part of the ROM, each part of the software, each part of the firmware is going to go on your phone. So right now I'm directing it to the location of my scatter and here you see at the bottom these are all the different parts of your firmware where they begin and where they end. Now there's one issue here and that is the cache and user data aren't part of the firmware. So you can do one of two things. You can either edit the firmware or edit the scatter and just remove those portions from the scatter. Just edit in a text file. You'll see the see cache and you'll see user data. Remove those areas from the scatter. Or you can just go ahead and click download. Download is fairly safe. However, firmware upgrade is safer. Okay. So at this point, if I was ready to flash my ROM, I would just click. I would remove my battery from my phone. Make sure the USB is not connected. Remove the U battery for a couple seconds. Put the battery back in, and boom. Then click download. At that point, these will go gray. That means it's waiting for your phone. I'm going to show you what that looks like. Here it's asking me not all images are correctly loaded. That's because these are not checked here. I'm just going to go ahead and click yes. You can either stop or now what it's doing searching. It's waiting for your phone. So at that point you would plug, it, plug in your phone and you would see the pretty little bars down here start to go, flash across as it flashes the different portions of the firmware. That's how you flash a full, full firmware, or a full ROM, a full upgrade, a full backup. Uh, if all these are selected, you can use the firmware upgrade option. Okay. The reason I can't use that now is because these are not part of the firm, not part of the ROM. So if I wanted to use this again, I would just open the scatter, remove these two portions from the scatter, and then resave it, resave the scatter, and then reload the scatter through here. Okay. Uh, if you wanted to just flash a recovery, that's your CWM here. What you're going to do is deselect everything else, and then you're going to locate your recovery. Uh, wherever you downloaded it to, it may, if you downloaded a CD, CWM to your desktop, you direct it to your desktop. Uh, just for uh, sake of showing you what I would do, I would just select recovery.image and then you're going to have to click download. Not firmware upgrade, click download. Not all images are selected, go ahead. And then at this point, remove the battery from the phone for a couple seconds, put the battery back in attach your phone and then you'll see the recovery start to flash that's it guys signing out if you have any questions come by chinaphonearena.com and ask away we'll try to get you helped out subscribe keep them coming